So, the only video that you guys are really interested in seeing right now is either a video with Dylan or a life update. So I decided to go with a um, life update. Um, I look like shit. I have like this horrible double chin right now, but we're gonna work with it. Um, so I'm doing a life update, and hopefully it'll be quick and simple because I don't really have a lot of time to film. Um, Impulster is watching a movie. So I grabbed the selfie stick and I was like, let's go in here and let's film. Um, so number one is you should notice a change in the quality of my videos. Um, Dylan bought me an iPhone for my birthday. So um, my videos should um, be a lot better of quality. I think I've uploaded a couple with it. Um, so yeah, I should have better videos up, which is always fun. I feel like, you know, I upgrade with my videos and then I end up downgrading again, so I'm not sure how that happens, but we're going to hope that, that doesn't happen again. Um, so yeah, uh, better quality videos. And then another thing is, is I got this puppy. She's a Weimer Arner, I don't know how to say it, an American Bulldog mixed with something else. Um, she is eight weeks old Sunday. But she's sleeping, so I don't know where she's sleeping at. But if she wakes up, then I will bring her in here to show you guys. Um, she is really hyper, and like when she like plays, it's like really really rough. Um, so she's been kind of a handful, and she whines at night because my mom doesn't let her in her bed. And me and Drew have been staying in mom's room because it's cooler in there. Um, and because Drew wants to sleep with his mama. Um, and so, mom doesn't let her in her bed because she pooped in her bed. So, she said that's a no-go. Um, but, she whines constantly. She never shuts up. If she's not in the bed. Um, actually, I think she was right here. Come here. She says, what, mommy? So this is Nova. Um, she's kind of a butt. Because she's hyper. Say hi, Nova. Um, so yeah, she's a hyper puppy. And she's... She's at, uh, right now she's playing with the cat. Um, but yeah, she's kind of a nuisance with her whining, but got another puppy. Um, we're also going to be moving. Um, we're moving completely out of the state that we live in right now. Excuse me, just because, um, right now we live in an apartment building, but we're going to be moving to a house. And in this house, Drew will have his own room. Um, the bedrooms are smaller than what they are here, but my mom, me, and Drew will all have our own rooms. So that would be nice. Um, and we're moving to a town that a lot of my family has already moved to, um, so we'll be closer to a lot of my family, which will be nice once again. Um, you see the boat? Um, hopefully it'll be within the next few weeks, but we're not completely sure yet. It was supposed to be at the end of August, um, but it's not looking like that. Look at that, like, giant pimple that's right here. Um, yeah, it's not looking like it's gonna be that fast. I was hoping it would, but it's not looking like it. Um, if you guys would want to see, like, a room tour, or she just spilled my drink, that's what I mean by, like, a nuisance. Like, she just, she's, like, only, like, seven weeks old, so she's just, like, into everything, and spills stuff, and doesn't pay attention with her big old body, and, anyway. So, um, we were hopefully looking at the last week of August, we would be there, but it's not... It's not looking as that, um, but I was wondering if you guys would want to see, like, 
a room tour or a house tour or something. I don't know. I don't know what you guys would want to see with that. I know, like, everybody wants an updated room tour. But then it's like, do you guys want to see Drew's room or my room? Or do you just want to see my whole house? So, um, go ahead and comment down below what you guys want to see. Um, and I will definitely try to follow up with that and all of that good stuff and get you guys, you know, the videos that you guys would want to see. Um, another thing I get asked a lot, Nova, don't you dare go in there, um, is like with Dylan and stuff. Um, I think it's been mentioned, you know, that he is in the service, he's in the army, and, um, I was like, well, how old is he? Um, Dylan's 20, he's been in the army for, I think, three years now, um, and I talk about, you know, missing him a lot and stuff, and as of right now, he is just a few hours away working with the army, but in September, he leaves for deployment overseas for 13 months, <laughs> um, so, here lately, videos haven't been up that frequent because I've been trying to spend, you know, majority of my time with him when he's not there working. Um, because, you know, he is leaving and I won't get to see him, so I've been trying to spend a lot of time with him. Um, I know that a lot of people want me to do a um, video about what it's like being with someone in the service. Hmm. <sighs> Excuse me. And, um, I was going to do that, but I thought it would be better if I did that video with Dylan, since, you know, it's kind of like what his input and what his view is on it, and then what mine is. And another thing is that Dylan wants to do videos while he's gone and, you know, discuss topics you know, me upload a video on my input and then him upload one or him upload and then I upload and then, you know, do one where together where, like, one of us is on Skype and stuff like that. So, um, if you guys want to go ahead and see that kind of stuff and you guys want to see videos together and if you guys would go ahead and go subscribe to his channel, just give this video a thumbs up and then, um, maybe we will make a video together when he comes in for a couple of days soon. We might make a video, and then I'll upload it, and I'll put his link to his channel in the description. Um, but go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you guys would want to go over there and subscribe. Um, so, yeah, it's not going to be an easy journey, and the next couple of months are going to be a little bit chaotic. Uh, especially the, the next month with moving and... Um, Dylan leaving and stuff. I know it's just, it's going to be an emotional time for me, especially. Um, 13 months is a long time, and um, I'm 17, and I'm in a, you know, very committed relationship, and it's going to be rough. It's going to be a little bit hard to handle, and, you know, it's, it's going to be different. I, you know, I always told myself I would never be with someone in the service because of that, because I didn't want to deal with, like, you know, having to go a long amount of time without seeing each other but then again you know I'm so proud of Dylan and I'm thankful for what he does and um it's a big it's it's different it is very different um I think you know people look at it a lot differently and I looked at it a lot differently you know it's like well you know it must be hard when a husband or a wife or you know a mom son, daughter, you know, anything has to leave for that, and it's, it was rough when Dylan left for training, um, he left for nine months for training back in 2013, and that was rough, um, and that was before I had dated him, uh, before, you know, I had pretty much fallen completely in love with him, um, so, yeah, I'm sure this time's gonna be a lot different and a lot harder, um, but, you know, I'm going to work through it, and, you know, that's why I kind of wanted to make a video about what it was like, because I wanted to give you guys, you know, my opinion and kind of what an insight on being in that kind of relationship is like, because I've gotten asked to do that video about 20,000 times. <laughs> um, anyway, that is all I had to say. Um, I'm currently in the process of potty training Drew. We've been working on it for about a week. Um, if you guys want me to make a separate video on that, I definitely will. I know that is requested a lot. 
So if you guys want to go ahead and leave a comment down below, if you guys want to see the potty training video, let me know and I'll try to get that up. And I can't stop hiccuping. Um, and I'll try to get that up because I know, you know, that it's a lot. A very, very requested video. Um, and has been since I've talked about potty training with him. It's not going as I planned, actually. Um, a lot of things are changed and he kind of does his own thing when he wants to. So... It's different than what I thought it was going to be, which, you know, I'll talk about more if I do a video on it. Um, but it's definitely a, it's a ride, let me tell you. It is not easy to potty train someone, someone, a baby, a kid. Um, Drew will be three next month, so it is kind of a late potty train. Um, I was hoping to have him potty trained by like two, two and a half. Um, but I did, you know, wait until I knew that he was ready, and he is definitely ready now. He hates being in diapers. He wants to wear underwear all the time, and if he pees in a diaper once, that diaper comes off. So, it's kind of to the point to where it's wasting money on diapers, um, and he has a million pairs of underwear, so... We're doing good. Um, so, yeah, uh, if you guys want to see, you know, any videos or you guys have any more questions about... Stuff that I talked about in this video, go ahead and comment down below. Like I said, if you guys would go subscribe to Dylan's channel and you guys, you know, want to see us, you know, discuss things or, you know, talk about, you know, things, why he's gone, go ahead and give it, or go ahead and um, comment down below because we will definitely talk about doing that and um, potty training, go ahead and comment. Um, I know somebody asked me to do a video specifically on Nova, so if you guys would want to see that, go ahead and comment down below, and just comment down below, because I need to know. Um, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope, you know, this wasn't as boring as I thought it was. It turned into, like, me thinking I would be done in, like, five minutes to me not being done for, like, 20. So, here's a cat. Nope, cat left. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you all have a terrific day.